and you should be unto me a kingdom of priests. And the Lord, he's, going, he's building this right now. That's what's happening. He first priest he raised up was Yahweh Shah. After the dead. Now that's we're gonna defeat death. That's what people don't get. They, they don't know this, they, they don't understand that's what this is about. It is about defeating death. Because Yahweh Shah defeat death. Because the scripture speaks about some of us not seeing death. That's another form of defeating death. Some of us that's gonna be put to death is gonna raise from the dead. That's another way of defeating death. And that ultimate download that the Lord's going to put all his Lord's touch of commandments in us, we're going to use our full potential of our brain and we're going to never going to die. That's the victory over death. Because scripture speaks about the victory over death. See, by us breaking all these commandments, that's why we die. Because that's a sin. Because Paul speaks about that too. He said, if you, if you, um, I think we had to go, no, I think Yahweh Shah, I forgot who said that. I can't remember what that verse They said, if you break, if you break one law, you, you're guilty of all laws. This is why we need Yahweh Shah. And you should be, all right, here we go. And you should be unto me a kingdom of priests. And a holy nation. These are the words which thou shalt speak unto the children of Israel. So right there, it didn't say all. It don't say the church. It don't say the, the children of the earth. All the people that I made. He just told you the earth is his, and that means he made everything. But he's only dealing with one nation. Racist statement all the way around. All right. Look, look at this one. <laughs> it says Deuteronomy chapter thirty-two, verse nine. For the Lord Yahweh, for the Lord Yahweh Shah, I mean, for the Lord Yahweh, Bashmi Shah, the portion of His people. Let's read that again, Salah. <laughs> Let's read this again. Deuteronomy chapter thirty-two, verse nine. The Lord's portion is His people. All right. I like to say the name Yahweh Hashem El Shah, all right? For the Lord Yahweh Hashem El Shah portion is his people, okay? His people, that's another, right there. It doesn't have a, it doesn't have a S at the end of nation, okay? Jacob is Jacob is his lot of his inheritance. All right, his lot. Jay, it didn't mention. Well, Edom also is a part of my my um a lot too. Moab is a part. I don't. It's not there. I don't see it. So no, the Lord is not dealing with everybody else. If you don't like how is um how the truth is coming out. Go jump off a roof. Because even a five-year-old can understand that, understand the word people now. I don't know. Hold on. What was the verse after that? Oh, yeah, okay, that was it. So that's clarified, man. I don't understand. Like, no. Y'all want to make it fit to your criteria? No. It's just say the Lord. It's his will. It's what he want. That's it. We can play the game. Well, you you, we can play the game, but you better be playing to win. Trying to make it fit to your criteria. You're going to end up being hit with one of those missiles. Straight like that. He says he come in the volume of the book. It's written of me. That means that, that means Yahweh Shah's a racist too. This is 
real. All right. This ain't made up. This ain't. I ain't trying to make it fit to my criteria. Oh, no. I'm reading it. I'm reading it as it is. I'm not changing no words. I'm not trying to put what I want to put in there. It's what it is. And you know what? That's the most. That's like the ultimate part I love because when I was young, I didn't read the book. I didn't read the Bible. So I'm not going to sit here and say I knew what was in the book. I didn't. But by reading this book, constantly in it, man, there's no way in the hell it's going to, all that shit that people talk in church, and then they go home and eat a ham sandwich. That's what he mean to do. Go home and be with a faggot. Go home and be with a lesbian. He ain't say that shit. That's not in the book. Um... All right, hold on. Let me see. That's what I was just because yeah, the Lord, the Lord was He did His damage to His people first. That was a that was what you call chastising. That's scripture. The Lord chastises His people He loved, but He's gonna when he, Isaiah chapter forty seven verse six. I was wroth. He go he go he go raise a statement. I was wroth with my people. I have polluted my inheritance. I have given am and given them into thy hand. Um Job chapter nine verse twenty four the earth is given. Let's read that real fast. The earth Job chapter nine verse twenty four. The earth is given into the hands of the wicked. The earth is given. So that means everything on the earth is given into the hands of the wicked. He covered the faces of the judges thereof. If not, where and who is he? All right. Here, now we read this. That will clarify. Um, Isaiah chapter 47, verse 6. I was wroth with my people. I have polluted my inheritance and given them into thy hands. Thus, thou doest, thou didst show them no mercy upon the ancient. Has thou very heavily laid thy yoke? Okay, that yoke is on our neck, our body. No way going around that. All right, that's just that's slavery. So you got the problem with yourself. You know what the problem is? You know what the hell to do with yourself. Because you want to say, you want to, you Stockholm Syndrome motherfuckers. That's why the two-thirds is about to, what's going to happen to you two-thirds is, is, is rightfully so. Okay. We're going to end it with this one. Isaiah, we Psalm chapter 35, verse 4. For the Lord Yahweh has chosen Jacob unto himself. There go the name. And what was Jacob's name changed to? Israel. How did his name get changed to Israel? Because he had a, he fought an angel and beat the angel. Okay, that's how his name became Yahshua Allah. You didn't read the book? For the Lord Yahweh has chosen Jacob unto himself and Israel for his peculiar treasure. Okay, just want to clarify that. I'd like to give all prayers and honor and glory to Yahweh Bashem, Yahshua Bashem, Yahshua the water of Yahweh Shah, forgiving us the apostles and the elders of great millstone, deserve double honors, rightfully so. Shalom to the Akim. Shalom.